Billions of years of evolutionary advancement. And then we have Cassie. What the? F what? Happy day, I am glad. We are picking up from the middle of episode four of Life is Strange, just because it took me a very long time to film this and I wanted to get them out faster for you guys. I also like to explore a lot. It takes a while. So here is the second half. Hope you enjoy it. God, I hate seeing those poor whales like I know, it's so sad. Me let's too. go. I just think of their I know, families right? in the ocean. Oh, it's I'm just heartbreaking. Okay, let's go. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. <laughs> and I might even save you someday. About time. Please save I'm me so someday. I'm so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me... Rachel, Warren, Rachel, Victoria. So let's play this cool. Mr. Jefferson. Okay? We could Just all go. Talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Okay. Hopefully, Frank didn't notice that we rummaged through his trailer. Because if he did, he's coming out swinging. And I'm really worried about it right now. How can all of this not be connected to a major storm? Man, wheels are big. Photo. Yeah. I really want to see all these photos. Oh wait, I can, can't I? Okay, let's go. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. Mm. Oh, dog bowl. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? So mean. We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Jesus. Okay. Okay. That didn't. That wasn't but I'm hard. I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you Hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your. Clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, well why He's not gonna you just tell, tell you that, you idiot. How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You already did. I'm not gonna say that. Help or else? I don't know about that. I'm sorry? I don't know about that. You don't get it? I don't know about that. Okay. Um, alright. Well, we might as well just exhaust all of these. I'm sorry. Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. I... I'm, I'm sorry so about that. I'm so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I... I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. I was just... Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay. We're cool for now. 
But my dog isn't. And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. Oh, looks like the first We're thing I tried here to talk. Worked. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? I love dogs. Pompadour is cute. Oh, Pompadour is Pompadou. so cute. The only way you know my dog's name is if you broke into my. Rewind! That's Rewind! You did it. Are you crazy? That's my dog. Wait, that's not what. Seriously, Frank, don't get all spun out. We're only here to find Rachel. Rachel isn't in here, and I'll spin you on your ass. What the fuck are you dorks up to, huh? Trying to break into my business? This time, the price is wrong, skank. Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Step the fuck back now! Uh oh. No, you don't shoot you a dog. Killed my dog. Okay. That was real. That got really ugly really quick. So we're rewinding, right? Right? You can't just shoot a dog there, Chloe. Like, come on. Oh no, Chloe. I just shot a man. And his yeah, dog. you did. Stupid. I killed Frank Powers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it was self defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Are we. Fast can we not rewind? Before the co cops come. Oh, maybe we can find the thing and then rewind. That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Are you... Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. Okay, 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 I don't like when dogs get shot. It's so rude. Listen, Chloe. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Yeah. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Okay. Be careful, you know? Just be, be careful, careful, okay? Don't give Frank any excuses to go ballistic. We need his help, Chloe. You know, I'm not a total fuck up. Occasionally, shut I up! I know more than you do. I can see through time. Okay? okay, okay. Close the door. No weapons. No fight. Obviously. Thanks for hearing me out, Frank. Look, we only want to talk, and it's not even about you. We're not here to start a fight. Hopefully no, this that works. shit would be over pretty fast. Don't fuck with me, and I won't return the favor. Okay. So what do you want? Just the names of some of your- Oh, is that all? Okay, so I'm sorry. I'm sorry worked well last time, so I'm gonna do Listen it again. To Frank. Yeah, yeah, everything. There's no okay, time. Okay, so he's gonna ask me about yeah, his dog. Yeah, well, it'll... Come on, Frank. And I shouldn't right, pretend okay. to know the dog's name, because that was stupid. Frank. Oh, yeah, you didn't- I- Finally. Shut up, let's go. I- Dude, she. We're only. Shit. Okay, okay. So I can't say Pompadou is cute because then we'll all shoot each other. I can't say gave dog a bone because that also indicates that I was near your dog. Train to kill, that sounds stupid. I'm gonna go with my initial instinct and say, I love dogs. I love dogs. Period. I wish I had one trained as well as yours. Yeah, he had a bad trainer before. Real bad. But he's dead now. And mm. I trained Pompadou how to be my friend. Aww, That's very cute. cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially from you. You come and on, Chloe do not on. know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? Rachel photo. Rachel said she gave you one of her favorite photos. Yeah. 
That proves how much she cares. Wait, do we not steal that photo? And you care. That's why you have to. Oh no, we just looked at it. How the hell did you know about that photo? Ah shit, are we gonna die again? That's my favorite picture of her. I can look at it any time, and she'll always be there for me. I can't stand not knowing okay, where she okay. is. Okay, okay, seems okay. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. Oh, they were we in love. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. Why would he trust us? Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. Oh, he loves her so much. It. That's cute. My dog isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Oh, wow. Really? So now we have two guns. Thank you. Not bad. Yeah. Maybe thanks, we didn't Frank. have to steal Nathan's. Uh oh. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Oh shit, Warren's gonna get expelled. Oh, what was I thinking? I really thought having the gun would be a good thing, but we got it back anyway. Ah. That was cool. Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. Well, I just saw something good in him. He doesn't seem like the worst guy. Just misunderstood. Damn, I, oh, my regret right now for letting Warren beat the shit out of Nathan is pretty substantial. Leave the beach. I ruined my life as usual. It's a fine looking wall. Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. All right. Gather info on a character by selecting all the correct Thanks clues. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about hmm. everybody? Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. Oh, Frank. Hi, Max. Just wanted to see how the search is going. Thanks, Frank. We're getting closer. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want to party. And good luck. Oh, Frank. Oh, I knew we'd be friends. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Hmm. Who does this car belong to? Sex fight nerder? Maybe it, this is Nathan's? I'm shooting in the goddamn dark here. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating, as usual. Ah, okay, so there's tape on the back left of this one, and there's tape on the back left of this one, so. We did, we did something right. So this is Sex Finder. Yep, is this Sex Finder? Another no, car that's David Twin was Peaks. tracking. That's not Sex Finder. That's not Sex Finder. That's Sex Finder. <laughs> Select. Oh, yes, now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. See if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Okay. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Holla! Okay. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Maybe something with a Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Yeah, let's give it. Let's give it a whack. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. <laughs> I'm gonna start with this paper. Um, nine five three five. Let's go. Nine five three five. Oops. Go. Oh shit. Bad code. Five. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. What about his SIM card? One 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 one. Let's try one 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 one. <laughs> that should be my ticket. Oh shit. One 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 one. You locked it, dumbass. What? Oh. Enter Pook. Okay, so the SIM card has a long number there. Eight seven eight nine seven eight oh eight. Oh. Eight. Let's go. Oh yeah. 
Let's go. Asgard has been trying to hide. Okay. What's up? Need the G? Okay. Cool. Bitch, you sold me water, asshole. Calm down. Bring it to me. Bringing it. Stay away. Pigs on the beach. Okay, that's really nice. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Oh. I'll call you to give you the exact directions. In transit. Get that money out. Drug dealer drama. You up, bro? No shit. What do you need? Peruvian flakes. Skidoo acid. You're paying night prices. Don't make me wait. Sorry for being a dick. You need more stuff? Or need more stuff, you home? Yes, don't come. Fuck off. Oh, wow. These drug dealers are mean to each other. God, Nathan. You're out hey, of control. Hey, need weed, etc. Now, calm yourself. You tweaking? Soon. Hook a brother up, please. Meet Beach. Be cool this time. So he... Yeah, he likes drugs. So a it lot. was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Ah, he texted this to me. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Hey. Asshole. He called me a feminazi too. I remember that. It hurt my feelings. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Nathan's father. Please do not contact me at work. I've told you this before and being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can get things done on his own? Impress me. I'd like nothing more than to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. Ooh, he's a disappointing, drug addicted person who likes to, uh, you know, prey on women. Booyah! Let's right. look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Drug deals during the week of the party. What is this? There's no doubt she loved him in some way. Oh, that's cute. Okay. What about this? Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but... I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. Hmm. Right? Frank's account book. The client names are encrypted. Okay, so I found out that his name is Rot, maybe short for Rottweiler, Nathan's like drug buying name. And also that Frank has this like encrypted book, but we found out his nickname, so we're good to go. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Oh shit, these papers look so boring. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could Boxer, open the Boxer, Bulldog, store. Beagle, Rot. Oh, okay. What about here? Yeah. I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Rot, okay. Select that. What about this one? Huh. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Hmm. Parties. Oh, yes. Yes. These are yes. all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's it, Max. So many clues here. Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data, and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Jesus! No time charge me. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is the 4th at 10.24 p.m. These drug dealers certainly keep a good record of their sales. Okay! Okay, 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 okay. Alright. Now, last but not least. Somebody is stocking up on gas. Why? Hmm. Not much out there. Hmm. Chloe, this is definitely the place. Nope. Nothing, Max. Ah, fuck. There's nothing here. Just some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. Yeah, maybe, I maybe I was right. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. I'm shocked. Ho oh. ho! Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed then up. Then what do we do? As you noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody. Except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could yeah, call, let's Warren, call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. Oh, for and I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. We gotta screw Nathan before Nathan screws Warren. And, like, where's Mr. Jefferson been? I haven't seen him in a while. 
We're going out to the barn, the barn where bad things happen. Woohoo! Woohoo! It's not a good thing. Okay. I can't wait to see what's in here. Ugh! I can't wait to bust Nathan. It's gonna be so good. Holy shit, this is scary. Yeah, you think they'd renovate it being so rich and stuff, but then here. if it looked Let's nice, find the best way in. it wouldn't be so inconspicuous. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we need How? to get in that barn. How do we get in here? Metal sheet, huh? Move it. We did Chloe, it. Chloe, I found the front door. Come on. Don't yell, it's scary. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. God, this is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Come on, Supermax. Hey, check out this old chest. What's in there? A little louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, no, no. look closer. Harry Aaron Prescott and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. Okay. My scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. Okay. I am the clue master. Oh, it's Warren. Are you okay? I didn't realize that beating the shit out of somebody would bruise my fists. Of course, I bruised his face worse. He had that coming. The whole fight was so insane. Yes, it so was. How are you doing? Amped up. I wouldn't want to do it again, unless I had to. You paid your hero dues. Now, we just need costumes. Speaking of, I hope you're coming to the party tonight so we can celebrate! Ah! I'll let you know, promise. Cool, now I have to go back to striking super poses. Oh, Warren, you are just too much. Okay. Yes. Wait, Nathan? Get ready to fucking die, bitches! Okay. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. I'm writing in regards to your outstanding dues that you have chosen to ignore. That's nice. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Nice America flag, some chickens. Oh, those were the days. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. Nice. Okay. What about this? Huh. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. Hmm. Ah, the good old days. Eggs, bacon, sugar, coffee, cocaine, tobacco, and milk. Damn, lots of info here. Really, Chloe, are you actually gonna find something for once? Ground? Old. <sighs> Nothing here. Huh? More ground. Just rotting wood. Okay. There's gotta be more ground. No more secrets, Sean Prescott. Whoa. What is this? It's totally brand new. What? Why? No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. Maybe I can use that pitchfork. Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got the hook. I hope. Yeah. Let's go. All right. How do I? Uh, how do I utilize this doodad? Like this. And we gotta climb Chloe, onto this platform. Can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Oh, we're so cute together. Look at us solving problems, Pump, little detectives. Pump it away, Supermax. I dig having minions. <gasps> Is that okay? That looks sturdy enough to stand on. 
All right, let's stand on it then. Yes. Yes. Okay, don't fall. Maybe I could rewind, get that thing up here, hook that up to that. Nope. I can't. Let's just let's just see how. It okay. Okay. Ah. Eh. Yes. But then, how am I gonna get down? I guess it's easier to jump down than it is to climb up. Okay, pull. Hopefully this works. Worked very, very well. More MacGyver strikes. More again. well than I thought it would. All right, let's get down. Yay! Oh God, yeah! I can't wait to see what's in here, but I'm also really scared. Open. Damn, this is heavy. Mm. What is no. this? Jackpot. Remember when Chloe Do said I that like to say how weird this is? Everything was really white, like the room was very good. white. Who built this kind of place? It seems like this A this was God, that room. Course. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay. This is messed up. Wow. This bunker is so surreal. What could the code be? Well, two, four, and five have been used the most. So maybe it's a combination. Let's just try. You can do it, Max. Okay. Um, maybe four, two, Wrong code. I just have to get five, lucky. four, two. Hey! Oh yes! I thought I tried that one I already. I thought that only worked in the movies. Amazing. Open sesame. I'm scared. I don't like this. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Oh my god, if we find Rachel down here, I'm literally gonna puke. Now what the hell is this? Shut up. You're scaring me. More survivalist supplies. Hmm. Look at these cans. And David must shop at the same store. Water supplies. It's like in David's garage bunker. Do they know the end of the world is coming? Or like, what's the deal here? What does this say? Whoa. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. Dear Mr. Prescott, as Nathan's primary psychiatrist over five years, I feel that I should stop seeing your son as you have disregarded my rather dire and immediate suggestions for his and others' well-being. You know well the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel that you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It's as simple as that. I fear he's becoming even more disconnected from reality, even if he acts in a personable manner. You have ignored my requests for a consultation with you and your wife, so I have to assume you are no longer interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan, and I believe he needs serious help. If you'd like to talk about this matter, I am always available. Oh man, he's mentally ill. I mean, we kind of knew that from before, but... I don't know what to think about the guy. Duct tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. Photo printer? What the hell? Oh, guys, I'm feeling Nathan nauseous right now. the most expensive printer in the world. What is going on in here? Ah! Talk about tortured. I'm not gonna sleep tonight. That is so scary. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Dear Nathan, Principal Wells has informed me that you have been suspended due to some of the suspect Vortex Club activity in your part. 
Okay, I'm just gonna click the read button because I can't fucking read that shit. Dear Nathan, Principal Wells has informed me that you have been suspended due to some suspect Vortex Club activity on your part. Never mind that, I just want you to know what kind of shame you've once again brought on this family. I've given you everything you ever wanted, including Blackwell Academy, among other things we shall not mention, but nothing is ever enough for you. You're still my son, and I want us to fulfill our destiny. That day is coming sooner than you think, so be prepared to step into that responsibility. This is my final warning, S. Prescott. Ooh what does the note say? Whoa. What is going on between Nathan and his father? Nathan, I've told you never to call me using your phone. Stick with the disposable ones I gave you. I don't want to hear you screaming out my name in a public place, which you have stupidly done before. I haven't set all this up and shared my vast wisdom just so you can fuck it up with your teen rage. We can accomplish a lot together. But you have to let me guide you, or you're on your own. Ew, what is it wrong with his dad, and what is wrong with that picture? What? Let's see what's I don't in like there. this! I do not like this! Oh I can't- God. I don't know if I can look at this shit. No. Okay, guys, I don't know. I don't know about this. It's making me, like, sick. Hey, those folders were in an ending once. We have to get Rachel's file. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, okay. the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. Oh, Gosh, that's scary. Back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Oh my god, we have to save Victoria. Oh my god! Chloe. These are all- these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe- maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard! Max, we have to find that spot now! Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. Okay, shut she up, Chloe. Features, like, can you at least not panic? You're making me panic. Oh my god. Rachel. This picture is framed. Ah! Rachel is awake and fucking furious. Rachel has passed out and she has something in her mouth. This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. Hmm. Can we keep these? Kate looks so doped up. She has no idea she's being posed. Why? Why? At least Kate was asleep through all this bullshit. Why? Oh, shit. That's Nathan's jacket. Into Sui 46A. Wow, that was oh, really the terrifying. Apocalypse Entertainment System. He likes to turn on the tunes for this. Ew. I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. So that's why he's into photography. He sets up little sh little shoots here. So who's using this fancy tripod? Okay, I'm glad I let Warren kick the shit out of him. For better or worse, I, I think that there needs to be justice. And this is disgusting. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. Mm -hmm. Okay, what about this? Somebody likes their whiskey. Okay. Needles? Uh. This must be the crap that Nathan gets from Frank. Frank? Needles. Gross. Eh. That's an original signed illustration. Fits perfect in okay. here. Okay, like, it's not, it's not cute, this situation. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. The dark room. Oh, that's what the dark room is. Okay. That's nice. Wow. So disturbing. Oh my goodness. Chloe, slow 
slow down. Wait for me. I know exactly where I'm going. I think I saw needles here. But it could have been from anyone. Look, this is it. This is it. Are you going to help me, Max? Chloe, stop. Look. What? Please, no. What? Oh. Oh. That smell. Rachel. Oh. fucked up for my taste, I think. Wow. And the music is so weird. And there's my spirit animal. Ugh. Well, at least we have the proof to put him in jail, right? I feel gross. I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck Chloe the wants police. to kill him. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially yeah. with you. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. What are we gonna do? How is Nathan out partying right now despite what happened to his face? Oh, shit. This is like that eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? It can't be too much. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. Awesome. Mm. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. <laughs> the world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you all right after today? I really flipped out on Nathan. I just hate bullies. Is he drunk? And Max, he's dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Are Let's you go, lying? Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but. Can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm painting the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. Aww, poor Warren. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. <sighs> No, oh, poor Warren. Hope he's gonna be okay. Nathan's a pretty diabolical creature. No, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, Chloe, 
Where the hell are you? Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It is. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? No. Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Nathan's creepy. Why does Nathan creep you out? He should. I, I just want your reasons. He's a bully for one thing, and he hit Warren for another. But have you ever looked at his eyes? Glazed and raging. Me no like. Hmm. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even Mr. with my Jefferson. job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually No, I not feel like okay. I'm gonna throw I, up right now, but... I just need to find Nathan. We're good. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Thank you. I still haven't seen Nathan. I promise to let you know. what the cool kids are doing, huh? I see, I see. The party was before all the shit went down, because then I'd be like, woo! But I'm just not into it right now. We need to find Nathan and take him down. Oh, hey guys. Hi, Daniel. That's what I like about Warren. Yes, Max makes an entrance. I only came to the party because of you. I'm glad to see you out and about. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Her face looks so serious. It's nothing. Oh, it, it's nothing. It's just a residue from all the Blackwell drama. It seems like it never ends. Yeah, it does. This is where it's going to end. For Rachel's sake. Oh, Max, you need a Blackwell brain. I'm taking Brooke to a Miyazaki show. Oh, cute. You I don't think Brooke wants me to come. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. I hope you stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll be celebrating someday in a museum, Max. Adios. Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you... No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. Okay. I just hate that scrub. And his Then what mom. are you doing here? Why are you here? So, why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Waiting? Hmm. Have you seen Warren tonight? No, I was talking to Dan. He asked me to go with him to the Portland Art Museum this weekend. Oh, um, that, that's so sweet. I bet Daniel will be a great museum guide. I'm more into science than art, but what kind of a selfish fangirl would miss a Miyazaki exhibition? You're yeah, for selfish, sure. Anyways, bye. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Oh, thanks, Brooke. Let's talk about the double moon. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. <laughs> well, the night is still young, Brooke. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. No one seems to know where Nathan is. 
he hiding or something? Oh, hi, Courtney. Energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has to do this. Hi, fashionista. There's Courtney drinking alone without Taylor or Victoria. I wonder why. Luke? Luke? I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? No big deal. No big deal. Really? You look pretty fucking intense. Is Nathan bothering you? Oh wait, I did see Nathan today. Nursing a busted face. I had dreams that somebody finally kicked his ass. Well, Luke, sometimes dreams come true. Warren gave him an epic beat now. Yes, give it up for Brother Warren. Woohoo! Okay, can we go? Thanks for seeing me. Cool. Oh, thank you. Look for helping Kate. Oh, that's and nice. Oh, <laughs> stop. Peace out. What the frick? Bigfoot on otter action. Okay. Oh, hi, Alyssa. Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> Alyssa, incoming. Alyssa, incoming! Why does she always get hit by stuff? Of course, my object angel is stepped up every single time to protect me from the cruel world. It'd be funny if she just got hit again. <laughs> Alright, love you, girl. I'm looking for Nathan. Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Oh, Good she's... luck. Yes, I I'm back. You scared me for a sec. I was ready to duck. <laughs> Didn't think you'd come back. I always warned you, what the fuck does that mean? I'm so glad I could warn you about all those sneak attacks. You kinda are a superhero. You always choose to help me. Okay. It reminds me of the only poem I can quote by a Robert Frost. Tell me. I could use one moment of poetry right now. Okay, but this is like poet karaoke. Don't frick. Okay. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere, ages and ages hence, two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less trapped by, and that has made all the difference. That was beautiful, Alyssa. It was exactly what I needed to hear. I actually have to go. Yeah, now. he's a good poet. I'll talk Let's to go. You later, Alyssa. Bye. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Let me Members in. Only. Okay. Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay. I know that Max Caulfield is not on any list for the Rude. Club. Rude. Nice try. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Okay, so I'll go talk to Courtney. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Or I could just take the damn door. Hi, Justin. Yo, Maximum Overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. Can you talk a little faster, please? No, I don't want to get ripped. Thank you very much. You look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is You like here. Dana? Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Mm. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too Yeah, old. yeah, get out of here. It's time to get my board and grind. Hello? Can you please hurl and flush already? Somebody's either having sex or throwing yeah, up. Like or both. Oh. Oh, gross. How did this even get here? Get Yuck. Okay. You don't wrap it up, in You're in my way. Oh god, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go talk to Courtney. Let's get through this party thing! Get out of my way! You drunk assholes. Hi, Courtney. Hey, Courtney. How are you? 
Max, our guest star arrives fashionably late. <laughs> Say bonsoir to the end of the world. Even though you flaked on my party makeover, Sorry. you still get special access to the Vortex Club VIP lounge. Yay, thank you. You better let your minion know since she won't let me pass. Oh, that little asshole just made her last mistake. She thinks she's Victoria. <laughs> bye bye Now, let's go make an official VIP entrance, Max Factor. <laughs> Get it? Okay. Hey, Sarah. Um, do you know that I've personally put Max's name on the list? So, you like decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> you're not in charge here. Wait, I, I just... Uh, oh my god, you're done. And you're off the list permanently. Welcome Thanks, to the Courtney. Vortex Club. Not bad. Sorry. Nathan is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be- Oh, his face just got caved in. Okay. Thank you so much for coming by, Max. You lifted my heart. Kate, I was so happy to see your smile again. You mean so much to me and to so many others. I have to go, but I also wanted to say have fun at the movies with Warren. He's so sweet and he brought by some school books I needed. Give him a hug for me. Oh, I'll call him as soon as I can. Warren is a little, a little cutie. What's up, Hayden? Uh, up in the sky, it's super max here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some... Dang, OG buds. Oh, I can barely see you. Okay. Or these hotties. Holy crap, it's so annoying being the only sober person at the drunk ass party. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too. He's supposed to be bringing some Ugh. special party favors. You kids and your drugs, I swear. But the party can you talk a little faster? Party shut, up, shut up, shut up, shut up! Hayden, does Sean Prescott pay for the Vortex Club parties? What doesn't he pay for? The Prescott's shit money. How else could we afford DJ Doomsday to spend? The Prescott family is literally making you dance. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a Vortex Club party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. Don't call me How that. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Hayden. Just watch out for Nathan tonight. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready. Wow, that was negative. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, Taylor. Oh what are you doing? Max, seriously, what are you doing here? Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? If I did, it's none of your business. This is a VIP area, so you should get back to the beach. Oh, eat shit, bitch. Eat shit, man. Enjoy the end of the world. Okay, like, maybe I will. My photo is very Oh, high. no, Victoria is so next on Nathan's hit list. Should I warn her? Ah, oh, nah. Uh, no, I have to. I'm trying I just won't trust her. Uh, Hi, Dana. Yay, Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. Mm. Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. He's so different than Logan. We actually talk about life. That's nice. And he knows how to be safe. That's nice too. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. Mm. What do you know about his dad, Sean Preston? Uh, rich and rich and a dickhead, according to Nathan. The Prescotts can't buy a happy family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No good on you. That sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. 
thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. <laughs> sure. Max, if you're not going to shake that booty, we'll have to talk after I do. Love ya. Oh, look at these two lovebirds. I heard they put in like Kate Martin. All right, maybe I should talk to Victoria. I kind of wanted to avoid it though, but I guess I can rewind if it doesn't go well. Hi. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, you Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I'm gonna tell her about Nathan. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cares she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. She's very protective of him. Here who cares what Nathan is going through? Oh. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Mm. You suck. Uh, I don't want to piss on her. I, I kind of want. I kind of need to warn her about. She's gonna get murdered soon. So, um, I mean, I do like her photos, but. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, should I kiss her ass or say she sucks? We're back in back where we used to be. Or should I just talk about Jefferson? She looks pretty mad right now. I don't think she's gonna listen to me if I'm mean to her. So I'm gonna say, you have talent. You have talent. Because Max actually thinks that she has talent. You don't have so. to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. Mm. No, it's it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always Aww, do. Aww, jeez. I don't either. That's I don't know about her. Hard to believe. I just gotta warn her so she doesn't get murdered. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? No, it's not fate. Uh, no, it's not fate because if Chloe's dad died, we would be very close. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. I gotta do it. I gotta warn her, I have to, Victoria, I have to. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but... He is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. Mm. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but... Please believe me. Please believe, believe me. Please. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people I've locked. Am I dreaming? Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him and stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. So it was good and that I, I have kissed other her ass with I the can paint. Go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. This is going well. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. 
Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Oh fuck, should I have done that though? Can I trust her? It's worth it, cause she might die, so. I'm glad I warned her. I hope she's okay. Hi, Chloe. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Oh, it's Maybe Mr. Jefferson. He's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. What is he doing here? Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, so he's at the party for a reason. It's not bad. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Why would he announce Thank the winner you. at a Vortex party? Isn't that a very exclusive kind of deal? I don't deal? want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest. Okay, who is it? Before Victoria, do, no doubt. I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Okay. The envelope, please. Oh my god, shut up and get and the to winner it. Is... Come on! Oh my. What a shot. Victoria, Victoria Chase. Victoria Chase. Of course. Oh my god! Of course. Good job, Victoria. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. Okay. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Okay. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. Rude. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Okay. I was kind of hoping I would win, but I didn't enter, so. Oh Christ! Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. What? Shit. What? We have to go to the junkyard right now. What? How did he find out that we found out about that? Can the world just end? Oh my goodness, this is too much. It's a mess. That is a pretty incriminating text, though. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Okay, okay, okay. Here it comes, guys. This is it. This is the hoedown throwdown. Oh, I can walk. <laughs> wow. Go, Chloe. Ew. So creepy out here. Where did she come from? Where did she go? Where is she buried? Cotton Eye Joe. Where? I got distracted by the damn light. Oh, there she is. Max, when we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him. Oh, oh shit. And can we over. Not? It's really Jeez, scary. Be quiet, okay? We have to be invisible. Yes, yeah, so why don't you turn off the flashlight there, Max? Rachel, I will get your revenge. I swear. Okay, here we come. Here it goes. Chloe! Come over here, quick! What? Oh god, Max, look! She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh! No! What? 
What? What? What? Chloe! Look out! What the fuck? That guy was so quiet. Can I rewind? Please. Please! Chloe got shot in the head. Like, that's, um... That's fatal. Chloe. Can I rewind, please? No. This game just hurts my heart. What? Who is it? What the? F what? You guys in the comments warned me about Mr. Jefferson, but I didn't know that he was that awful. Now this is a preview for the next one or what's to come. Yeah, I mean, that's the same thing. <laughs> kind of tired. Please. So is this Mr. Jefferson's thing? Is Mr. Jefferson? Like, is, is Nathan just sick? And Mr. Jefferson is behind this? Well, that was really something. I've been filming for four hours and 10 minutes and I'm gonna try to edit this down so it's a little bit easier for you guys to watch. This one was a really, really hard episode to play. So much emotions in my mind right now and I don't know. I really like the game though. It's very unique and it shocks me and it makes me feel things that I would have preferred not to feel, but some things are good too. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it one of these and make sure you subscribe to give that gloomy subscribe button a bit of a pick-me-up. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!